Well, the video I just posted of the Italian doctor and his warning against taking the vaccine for this COVID-19 was removed. And here's what I was sent. It was removed within uh, uh, probably about an hour, um, about two hours after I posted it. I don't know how many views it got, but you can read here. Your content violated YouTube, YouTube's community guidelines and has been removed. Our team has reviewed your content and unfortunately we think it violates our community guidelines. We removed the following content from YouTube. Warning from MD concerning COV-19 vaccine. I guess uh, things like that don't work anymore. Instead of spelling the word out, you hyphenate. Uh, we know it's disappointing. Well, yeah, it's disappointing because you're hiding the what could possibly be facts, um, which I believe, anyway, to be true and factual, that this whole thing is was a doorway for them to get in and stifle our rights and to basically do whatever they want. YouTube is a safe place for all. Yeah. If content breaks our rules, we remove it. If you think we've made a mistake, you can appeal it. Well, there was no mistake because if you keep, and we'll read it down here, YouTube doesn't allow content that explicitly disputes the efficacy of the World Health Organization or local health authorities. Well, when the World Health Organization is the one who the the major body in this who are um well first let me say that bill gates who is behind all of this with all his money is the second largest financial contributor to the world health organization behind the united states government who uh, donald trump is thinking about removing the funds from the world health organization not that i support trump and uh in any capacity I, I try to stay neutral and I support my Heavenly Father and his laws so the World Health World Health Organization they're the big bullies on top who are dictating what can be they dictate and then YouTube follows what their dictation so it's all it sucks you know I'm almost at a loss for words and uh, Oh, let's see, local health authorities recommended guidance on social distancing and self-isolation that may lead people to act against that guidance. Well, I don't think that video leads anyone to act against anything that's been set forth yet because there is no vaccine yet. And there is testing. And how does testing, when your body already has that, what they're calling the COVID-19 in you your body produces that naturally it's in everyone and it is an avenue for the body to expel foreign material um it says it's my first time but it's actually the second video that i've had taken down um the first one was the great covid cover-up so i don't know what i'm going to do because if I don't want to fight it and then I don't want any other backlash happening because of that, but I guess there wouldn't be any. So I might as well just go ahead and dispute it and see what happens. That way I can know the process um, of appealing. So I think I'm going to do that. Um, I hope you got to see the video. If not, I will uh, figure out a way to this one is important so I'm gonna figure out a way to get it in and I'll title it something very nonchalant and uh, in reference to something like uh, something that grows out of the ground let's do that so if you see a video title and it's about something that grows out of the ground check it out and I'll have that uh, video reposted in there